There's always been a relationship in Silicon Valley between psychedelics and innovation in the tech business. So at Sophia University, it gives us another connection to future therapists, to students, to an academic setting. It's a real pleasure that we are now linking up with MAPS, that we're both, in a sense, cutting-edge institutions, and we are also mainstream institutions. Our primary limitations right now are twofold, financial, and also figuring out how to train therapists. So what we're trying to do is create a model where profit maximization is not the primary objective, but social benefit is. Disruptive technologies that radically change what's happening, this is disruptive technology. We really do have a chance of uh, reintegrating psychedelics into our culture, and it's through medicine and through science that those are the ways to change the cultural attitudes about drugs and to help us overcome this horrible burden of prohibition that is so self-destructive. We're all part of this together, and if we can identify as what we share with others is greater than what's different, then we'll have more tolerance and compassion and empathy. This is not just transformational, but it's a game changer. This could really change people's lives.